vaccinated, so he was all vaccinated human being, all 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 chilling and stuff. Even though he was stressed, <laughs> he was really stressed. The guy was like, "Give us, give us the document." He was like, "Take off the mask." <laughs> We are reporting live from Skopje. We are headed to a new destination, new memories, new adventures. So let's see, let's see how things go. How are you feeling? Feels good, feels good. It's gonna take us around an hour and a half to get to Kosovo. So we got this car for like $340 for a month. Pretty nice if you ask me. Show you a bit the nature and you know the the road to to Pristine and um, hopefully uh, the border the borders will not be as uh, as tough as they say. But we'll let you know on the way. So stay tuned. Travel soft Muslim. And if you like my content, please make sure make sure to, to hit that like button and subscribe. Either. So basically, what happened was uh, they so the so the, as, I, as I said, there's two borders. Yeah, the Macedonian border. They asked us for some paper, which I did not understand much because he was like, "Do you speak uh, Macedonski?" I was like, "Nah." And he was like, "What do you mean, nah? You just spoke Macedonian, right?" And I was like, "No, no, 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 Malko, Malko, like little." And then he was like, "Okay, so um, you need this police for paper." And I was like, "Okay." Uh, I showed him a different paper and he was like, no, that's not the paper we want. And then eventually he was like, okay, that's okay, don't worry, you know, go ahead, pass. And then we went to the Kosovo border. And the Kosovo border was like, uh, so uh, do you have PCR tests? And I was like, no, I don't have a PCR test because you don't need a PCR test. We called the embassy, they told us, you know, Norwegian citizen does not need any uh, PCR test to enter, you know, uh, Kosovo. And, uh, and this guy here, he had a vaccine, you know, vaccinated. He's a vaccinated, so he was all vaccinated human being, all 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 chilling and stuff. Even though he was stressed, <laughs> he was really stressed. The guy was like, "Give us, give us the document." He was like, "Take off the mask." <laughs> <laughs> oh, Anyways, so we made it. <laughs>
we are at the Albi Mall, which is one of the biggest malls here in uh, Rishtin. We just ordered some food from uh, Pasa Dune. Looks good. We missed some Turkish, you know, good meat. So we shall see how that goes. When it comes to the mall, there's a huge mall. There's such a like, there's so many different stores here. Every kind of European stores. Um, the only thing though is that we were looking for a SIM card because we still do not have that. And for some reason they don't even have a store, like a phone store here, that we can buy a SIM card. So we have to go to a different place, uh, which is difficult considering we do not have no internet on the phone. But uh, we'll get there, we'll get there. Hopefully this, this food will be good. Let's see. Basically, you can't buy a SIM card apparently at the, at the, I forgot the name, it's called IPCO. You can't buy a SIM card because uh, you have to have uh, some sort of, like, I don't know, maybe you have to be a citizen in order to buy a SIM card. It makes no sense. So we're going to go and try a different place to see if they actually sell any type of like prepaid. Let's see. 